Hi guys, welcome back to Urban Mechanics. Today we're going to show you how to replace the throttle body on a Ford Focus third generation from 2012 up. This one is the 2.0 engine and this is the throttle body right here. We got that Ford Focus, it's hit a little bit in the front and as you can see it has a crack intake. So what we need to do now, we're going to replace the intake and we're going to show you how to replace the throttle body in case you have a problem with it. You need to loosen that hose clamp there and the one right here with a flathead screwdriver. You need to push right here in and pull up to release that vacuum hose. Okay, and you just move it a little bit out of the way. And now there is one more hose on the back right here. Okay, you just pull it to the side and pull out. Okay, and this hose will come out, that vacuum hose. And now you can help a little bit with the screwdriver to remove the boot right here. So that way you don't have to remove the air box. Okay. And you pull it up and then once you loosen the other bracket on the bottom you'll be able to pull the hose out of there. Make sure that they are, they're loose all the way otherwise they will not be able to come out. It's a little bit of a tight fit but you'll be able to take it out. Okay, you move it back and forth a little bit, just careful not to break it then. Okay, it comes out of there, that's it. Now it's the time to inspect it for cracks and leaks because over time they tend to crack, it's a weak spot and if it has a leak, you can have a high idle or even the engine not starting at all. Now the throttle body as you can see it's right here and it has four bolts that we need to remove with the 8mm socket and extension right here. Okay we got the four bolts loose and now all we got to do is just pull them out. Okay right there and once you pull them out we just have the wires now but we can do that when we lift it up. Okay like that usually they are stuck because of the gasket and now the wire what we need to do in order to remove it you need to press the red thing back and now you need to press and pull at the same time okay like that and now this is guys the throttle body if you need to remove it or replace it that's how you do it it's good to clean them once in a while this one has only 40,000 miles or so and it's still pretty clean so thank you guys for watching us, don't forget to subscribe and give us a like, we upload at least one new video every day.